Right, there are quite lots of um, ingredients here that I'm going to use. I'm going to be using chicken. I'm going to be cutting this into shreds. And I've got the suya, the suya um, spice pepper here. And I'm going to be using garam masala, which is very good. I'm also going to be using um, the gayen, the gayen powder, powder or spices. I'm also going to be using um, paisley in, in making my chicken shawarma. I'm going to also be using bay leaves, so that's bay leaf, some of the bay leaves is going there. Paprika, very important, if you want to do yogurt, so I'm going to be using yogurt with the, the chicken to, to marinate it. Now we need both the lemon zest and the lemon juice itself, orange zest and the juice itself, and um, definitely we need onions and a bit of garlic. Um, it's very very nutritious. Um, definitely, we also need vinegar. I'm going to be adding some piece of vinegar into, into that. Um, I've got the lemon juice here, but I've got the lemon, the real orange, uh, with the lemon, so I don't need, need to use that. The last but not the least, yeah, we've got the tortilla wrap here, which I'm going to put in that into. Now, this is the garnish, it's the mayo. You can make your own mayo by mixing. Um, uh, tomato ketchup with mayonnaise, but I like using it, so it saves me from time, you know, doing that. Right, this is the vegetables to garnish that at the end. So, to start with, a long way to go. To start with, I'm just going to slide my chicken and then uh, take it off from there. This is 700 grams of the sh shredded chicken. I'm going to do for 700 grams of shredded chicken, I'm going to add two full teaspoons of yogurt. Two spoon of yogurt, zest of lemon, and the juice. Orange zest. Chopped onions, two teaspoons of soya mix. spoon of garam masala one spoon of paisley one teaspoon of cayenne pepper half a teaspoon of allspice three cardamom pots Paprika, that's one teaspoon of paprika. Two bay leaf leaves. A bit of vinegar. Chopped garlic. Now cube. Notice I've not put salt at all. Why? Because the gnaw itself contains lots of salt. No salt. So what I need to do now is just to mix. Normally, you can cover this with a film, a clear film. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to use a freezer bag. Which is that. I'm going to use a freezer bag and put all this. Is a bag another four to eight hours, but when I'm going to do this, I'm going to put it overnight. Then tomorrow, um, I'm just going to put it in the fridge and just for it to marinate. Take it from there. Right, because um, eight hours. 
after eight hours now. I left it overnight, so all the chicken shawarma is kind of marinated inside. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to cut that now. Pour that in the bowl. So that, those are all the shredded chicken and they've all been marinated and they really look really look lovely and I love the smell. Right, at this point what we're gonna do, we're gonna pour some oil. Um, three teaspoon of, uh, sorry, three tablespoon. About three tablespoon of, at this point now I'm gonna just pour some of it. I'm going to do now is to add it to uh, once I've made it all. I'm grilling and cooking is going to finish up in the, in the grill. So what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to put that in the grill. What I'm going to do now is just to turn this around. Start with what I'm going to do is to pour a bit of that just from a big round spring, spread that around, put some chicken. Make sure you're forming your chicken in a straight line because uh, you see the reason in a minute. There we go. Then if you like put some springs, spread some vegetables on it. I love to do still on a straight line as much possible just want to add a bit more there to be rich then I put some of my ooh, that's it put that in there I put some garlic sauce on it spread it around perfect now, to fold, you have to start from the side, bend it in, and you fold in there, squeeze it. It's ready now. I'm um, just going to show you. It's really lovely. Just set that in the plates. And um, thank you for watching the chicken shower my video. I've just finished making it now. I'm sure you enjoyed watching the video. Please subscribe, you know, like us on Facebook and leave your comments. I'll definitely reply. To the next video, I want to say thank you and bye-bye.